Hello everyone, this is Abhinav. So in this video, I am going to tell you about how to practice problems on CodeSafe. So in CodeSafe, lots of problems are present. In CodeSafe, every month there are so many contests held where you can practice, where you can participate to practice problems, to improve your problem solving skills. So in this video, our main focus is on how to practice problems on CodeSafe. Okay, so here is the practice section. You can check out the practice section. Here it is the practice problem section. You can go towards it. So here, this is the practice section of CodeSafe. You can practice problems here. Fine. You can see that there, there are three sections. One is all practice problems, means the practice problems, all the practice problems which are present in CodeSafe. This is recent contest pro problems, means the, the contests which are held recently. For example, here it is written uh, start. 36 means the problems of starters 36 is there which is who is taller or seven chapters like this here is your to-do list you can also add problems to your to-do list if you see that yeah this is a very good problem i have to revise it later or i have to solve this problem later you can save it to your to-do list it will it will tell you have you attended or have you not attempted your saved problem fine so now the main section is all practice problem where you can practice problems you can practice problems randomly to increase your to improve your problem solving your ability so here are some features also given to us okay the first feature is your problem rating it will show problems of your difficulty okay for example because i am a five star coder so here it is written five star so it is rec recommending me the five star rated problems which are good for me which are of my difficulty or, or above my difficulty if you are for example a two star coder so maybe you have to uh, practice for the two, adva two star advanced problems or you have to practice for three star beginner level problems. Okay, so I will ch check the three star beginner level problems here. So you can see all the three star beginner level problems here. There are around 125 problems. You can practice that. Same here you can get how many problems have you attempted. Fine. Yeah, this is. So this is what how we can do we can also solve problems on the basis of topics and tags for example i have to solve problems of binary search so i will just click binary search and all the problems of binary search are here yeah or for example if i have to solve by tag i have to just click uh, for example algorithms so all the problems written on algorithms are there okay so this is how you can also filter your search you can just solve problems in the target with, for example, if you, if you want to practice problems of basic programming, arrays, string, math, you can solve topic wise here also. For example, your, your sorting is very weak. So you can just select the sorting and you can solve for the sorting problems. This is how you can practice. So this is how you can practice on code set. So let's pick a problem. For example, I have picked this chef and cakes. Okay. Then yeah, this is a problem open for you. So you can easily read the problem statement. You can then check the input and output part, how you have to take input, how you have to output your answer. You can check for constraint, for sample output, and then you can easily submit your problem. This is how you can do. Okay. So this is how you can practice problems on code you can also move towards the discussion part to check that what are the discussions related to this problem if you have any having any doubt you can check for other solution also you can check for your past solution you can check for successful solutions okay so that for example i am not getting the solution for this problem then i go towards the successful solution i will check the solution for this user so yeah this is the solution for user i can check for here i can learn from from this that what is the mistake i am doing Okay, so this is how you can practice problems on CodeSafe. So if this video is helpful for you, please like the video, comment helpful and subscribe the channel. Thank you.